Jessica and today I have kind of a haul. It's uh, what's in my Ipsy bag for December and also um, some products that Sigma sent me to try out that I'm just going to show you what they are. And then also um, some new boots that I got, ah! which actually I'd mentioned in my last haul that I was waiting on them and they finally came in. So, um, first of all, guys, this is my hair naturally curly. Just, I was realizing I have not worn my hair naturally curly in a video, I don't think ever. And this is how I used to wear my hair like this just every single day of my life. Um, so I decided to do it and it's just, it's so easy. I forgot how easy it is. So you might see this a little more often. Um, plus my boyfriend always, every time I wear my hair naturally curly, he's always like, please wear it like that more often. So I think I'm going to. Um, if you haven't noticed, I got a pug lug in the video. He wanted to be a part. Hey, hi, look at him struggling. He's like, stop holding me that way. Hey, buddy, bud. Anyway, um, okay. So, where to begin? We'll just, uh, let's start with the Sigma products because they're right here in front of me. They sent me two different brushes. Um, they sent me the P82 brush, which is an eyeshadow brush. I'm assuming it's called the Precision Round brush. I've used it and I used it for kind of like a buffer color today. And it's kind of, I don't know, it's a little large for my liking for my eyes. So, not a big fan. I don't know. I mean, I like the way the brush is, but I don't think I like this actual brush. Are you going to be okay, Simba? Are you going to be okay, buddy bud? Anyway, so I also got the Sigma F82, and it's one of their bigger uh, face brushes that I liked. I used it for foundation. Um, I like it. I think I liked my angled one better, which is the F. 84, I think. It's very similar, but it's angled. I think I like that one better than this, but they're nice brushes. Um, and then they sent me um, one of their eyeshadow bases in Persuade I've been using. It certainly holds on to the shadow, um, and it's just a very neutral color. I mean, I like it. It's not, I don't know that it's my favorite yet, but I've only used it a few times. Then they also sent me an eyeshadow that I would never wear. It's um, in the shade Elise. I have no idea how to say that. But it's like a brown, deep brown color, which I just don't wear this very often. You know what? No, it's like purple or brown. Maybe it's like a purple. I don't think I realized. There's the, um, like a finger swatch. I guess it, it is more of a purple. Again, though, I don't think I'd wear that color very often. It's definitely pigmented, but anyway, so that's that. That's what they sent me. Um, Simba, just chill out. Do you guys hear him hitting the little thing? He wants to leave my room. Hold on. Okay, so those were the products that Sigma sent me. So on to what's in my Ipsy bag for this month. They always come in this, $10 a month. Um, it'll be linked below. This year's theme was, it just says celebration, which I guess makes sense for December. There's a lot of holidays going on this month. Um, okay, so I actually really like the bag this month. It's this cute black one that's kind of almost like a quilted pattern, but it's a really cool feel. And I kind of like that the zipper's like, a third of the way down into the bag. It's really cute and it just feels more well made than some of their past bags, that's for sure. The inside is like this deep red. Isn't that pretty for the holidays? I just love this. So it came with um, some strip lashes from Andrea, or Andrea, however you want to say it. Um, I don't see like the number or anything. Of, oh, duh, number 33. It's right there, right in front of me. I usually don't wear fake lashes, however, We'll see. I'll certainly hold on to it. It came with some adhesive, of course, as well. Um, it also came with the Pop Beauty um, eyeshadow trio in Smoking Hot. It's like a silver gray and then like a deeper black. I don't know that I'll keep this because these aren't colors I wear, so I might just leave it closed because it might be in a giveaway or maybe I'll give it to someone for the holidays. We will see. Um, came with this tiny, tiny little nail polish. It's like yellow and black. It's I guess the brand is Star Really and it's Buzz Buzz or Bzz Bzz. I don't know. We'll see how like opaque it is. It seems odd that it's so small. It's like a, just a glitter. This would have been great. My high school colors were like gold and black. It would have been great for that back in the day. Um, okay. Also, it came with the Be a Bombshell. It's called the One Stick and it's in the shade Flustered. I don't know if it's supposed to be like a NARS multiple type of thing. It's certainly like the size of one. I'm assuming this is like a cheek stain, lip. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, let's see how this like blends. So I'm, 
It could be. Yeah, I'm assuming that's what it's supposed to be for. Like a cheek stain and a lip stain. Oh my gosh, my hands are going to get a hand stain. <laughs> but it's, it's nice and big. It's a color. It's a color. It's red. We'll see. Oh my gosh. Well, I've certainly made a mess of it. I know that much. Oh my gosh. When will I learn to keep baby wipes near me? When will I learn? I go through this every time I film a video. Okay. It also came with a lip, uh, NYX lipstick. It's one of their round ones in the shade Sunflower. This is Lip Smacking Fun Colors. And it's, I mean, really, it's a red. Do you guys see my hand? Look at this mess. That's only from two products. What is wrong with me? We'll swatch it right there. It's kind of like a corally red, really. It's pretty. It's this one. I know, you guys don't like, look at this. It looks like it's a joke. Look at my hand. I'm a mess. Oh, I have to leave for rehearsal in like eight minutes, so I need to like get this going for real. So I really like the bag. Honestly, I don't really like any of the products. The lashes I won't wear, the shadows I won't wear. I probably won't wear this nail polish. Probably won't wear that lipstick. We'll see. And then this one stick, I need to just try out and see how I like it. But not in love with any of the products. I like the bag a lot. Here is the kicker though. I had some Ipsy points um, that you can get for referring friends and for uh, reviewing the products you get in your bag. Um, and so I cashed them in, if you will, for a beauty blender. And it just came like in a little bag, but it's a regular beauty blender. Just their original, it's the normal size. When it gets wet, it gets bigger. Um, and then it also came with like a little sample um, size of their cleanser, which I've never used, so I'm excited to try. But gosh, I would pay $10 for this. Are you kidding me? Beauty blenders are like 20 bucks. And my beauty blenders are like all gone now because one ripped and the other is just old. I had to throw out. So for these alone, I think it's worth it. But the rest of them, eh, we'll see. You might see some of those in the giveaway soon. I don't know. Speaking of giveaways, I have two going on. I'll link both below. One is for like bath bombs and bath products. And the other giveaway is for um, some makeup from Palladio or Palladio uh, Beauty. So, so the last thing I wanted to show you guys were the boots that I got. Um, I got them through Ebates, um, so I got like $10 cash back from it, um, but they're Madden Girl boots, and, um, but I got them from the website shoes.com, which I'd never ordered from. Um, they're these like, kind of like deep brown, taupey, I don't know what to call them, because it is like a brown, but it's almost got like a gray tone to it, which is exactly what I was looking for. They have this buckle detail, my favorite detail though, let me show you them on this one. Ooh. Look at that. Oh, isn't that so cute? With like the studs on both sides and then the red with the bronze zipper. Oh my gosh. Like these are exactly what I was looking for. I can't express to you enough. Um, and it was a really good deal I got on Cyber Monday. And then like I said, through Ebates, I got $10 cash back. So it was kind of a win-win situation there. But really excited to wear those boots. I'm thinking about making myself wait. This might sound silly, but I'm thinking of what, making myself wait until Christmas to let myself wear these new things I bought for myself. Because I don't, this is the first year I've ever bought things for myself in December, really. But I really wanted these boots, and it was such a good deal. And then same with, like, my recent haul with some clothes. I might make myself wear. Although, this I got at Kohl's, and it was in my haul, and it is so comfortable and so cute. So that one I did not wait on. But is that dumb? Maybe. But whatever. Whatever. Um, anyway, so that is all. I should probably go to rehearsal, huh? Um, but I will catch you guys very soon and I hope that was fun and yeah, <laughs> bye guys.